Episode 4, Floor 2. Um, of course, you first see this map from the original Wolfenstein 3D. It is shown uh, in like a demo advertisement. Uh, but it is a fun map. I do enjoy this map. What I think I like about this map is the fact that since you're working with the outside perimeter and you can wander into rooms that you can set off enemies that lead to other rooms that could alert more enemies... It's like you can somewhat set your own traps in this map, which I like to set up my own challenges sometimes to overcome. And it is, you know, it, it is neat. It, it, it gives you a little more freedom and creativity, especially when you're doing like a Let's Play uh, as well. Of course, there are a lot of enemies that are like further down hallways too, or in big bunches like there were in... Um, in, um, in, in the, right by where the gold key is, um, right, right by those couple of alcoves. There was that one spot, there was a ton of brown guards, and just one rocket launcher did take down a good, like, what, six enemies? Which, again, is a good advantage for you because um, of that splash damage. It could definitely, you know, help you overcoming big groups of enemies. Um, of course, as I said before, and I even, even in, like, upcoming floors as well, um, you still gotta be wise, as you know, I am, again, I, I, when I do these Let's Plays, I do not want to bore you by using the same weapons and overcoming the same things at the same time. But sometimes you do gotta be a little, a little bit more, more careful, for sure. Uh, what also stands out about this map, though, is that jumbled secret, um, with all the red walls leading to the blue room with all the treasure. Um, as I've said probably before, you need to be careful when navigating that. Because not only can you easily block off the blue room, uh, which I've fallen for so many times because of that green swastika in the midst of those jumbled secrets, but you can also push the wrong wall back and accidentally trap yourself in there and cannot get out. So that is something to definitely be aware of. But like I said, it's really not as hard as it looks. But you can, of course, you know, create your own challenges, it feels like, with the... Um, with the mosh pits and like enemies wandering to other rooms. But that is it now for floor two. On to floor three in the next video, which does have the secret exit to the secret floor of this episode. And it is definitely one of the harder maps in the game when we get to that secret floor. But first, we gotta go through floor three. And until then, guys, I am the Club of the Man, 1993.